Hello, this is Lance Cleveland. I'm going to show you some web automation using Selenium. This is Selenium, what they call WebDriver or Selenium 2, not Selenium IDE. And I'm using Node.js and JavaScript. So one of the first things I'm going to do is make sure that I have Safari 10 or 11 and enable remote ad automation. So I've got that turned on already. The uh, environment I'm using here is PHP Storm. I use it to write my WordPress apps, and I'm also uh, using Node.js. I've got Node installed, and I've got the libraries um, all set up. And you can see it's installed Selenium WebDriver and Selenium Drivers. That's just a standard NPM install. You can find instructions on my blog at lance.bio. So in this case here, I've got some other examples that I'm building on, also on lance.bio, uh, where I'm going to set up my WebDriver and I'm gonna do some basic logging. And one of the things I'm testing here is adding log information, like uh, just starting a test. And in this case, I'm gonna fire up the window, set it to a specific size and position, and then I'm gonna open my Store Locator Plus dashboard, type in an email password, click the Submit button, wait for the page to load, wait 10 seconds, and then quit the driver. So with everything set up correctly, you should see this run here. You can see the logging down here. You can see the log message. You can see it's actually typing things in for me and it's now logged in and validated the title of the page. So that's a very simple test. Also with Safari, you can tell it whether you want to continue running automatically or stop the session if you want to interact with it in any way. Um, so I just killed it with stop session. That's why I got that error message. And you can see my logging down here. So you can um, see how we can do some very interesting testing of apps as well as app automation using uh, Selenium with the JavaScript library available in Node.js and you can imagine um, what sort of tests I can write and automation I can run on the web and start gathering and collecting data or uh, automatically testing my apps which is what I'm doing now with a completely rewrite in Selenium of our Store Locator Plus tests. Uh, if you have any questions, you can always post a comment on the Lance.bio blog. As always, thank you for watching.